<laughs> All right, viewers, welcome to part two of my interview with Sexy Marissa. Marissa, first of all, welcome back to New York. Oh, well, thank you. I know you, you had an amazing trip and an amazing experience. I want to know a little bit what it was like. I mean, you know, you're representing all of us here in New York, Guyanese, Trinidad, everybody. You're our representative. So um, what was the experience like? A little backpacker that they did have another um, New York artist that's um, called Shiva Lakan. He was also on the semifinals. Yeah. OK, well, correction, female artist. <laughs> female artist, <laughs> and yes, yeah, sure. Tell us a little bit of what it was like. Starting oh. from the plane, going straight into Trinidad was amazing. Um, every step of it, the experience was really nice. Um, I miss Trinidad. I can actually move back there. <laughs> <laughs> um, being on the stage and representing a female um, from Queens is pretty good. Um, doing what you love is, you know, that, that's very important. So, when you got to the actual complex, what was what was it like? I mean. Was it media? What, being well, in the... To the actual event, the, the actual Monarch. Being at the Monarch, um, right. they had around about 1,200 people at the oh, venue. Yeah. Okay. Um, being there, yeah, a lot of people. You meet a lot of different artists. You meet a lot of different um, people that's in the business for, you know, from Chani Soka Monarch. Mm -hmm. So. Okay, nice. Media was nice. Um, we had um, one-on-one. You know, they supported a lot. They, uh, we did interviews with um, the Bungalow Factory <laughs> in Big Ridge. And you gotta understand, this is my partner in crime here, so you know, we got a little inside jokes every now and again. Um, when you got there, what was the response? By the people. I mean, you being a foreigner and you're uh, there amongst you, all locals. I can locals. actually hear people say, "Oh my God, that's that, that's that's the girl from New York. That's Marissa." And I was just like blushing. <laughs> <laughs> and did you meet quite? I mean, I'm sure you met all the big uh, names. Yes, right? I met all the big names. I hang out with them. They're pretty nice. Ki, um, Anna B. um, you know, all the big names. Um, S. Storm. Yeah, every artist that um, some late damn, what's her name? Yeah. Denise Belford. There we go. She's quite a great um, soca artist. Mm -hmm. um, Mr. Killer from Grenada. He had one of the biggest songs, Roly Poly. I have a, mm -hmm. I had a actually conversation with him, you know, about his feeling and stuff about it and it was he's he's really down to it, really cool guy. I saw you also did an interview with the man himself, Big Rich. What was that like? Um, Big Rich, he's really cool. He's um again, everybody's down to it, you know. They come at you with the questions, but you know, you come right back at it. There you go. And I know you can answer it, so Oh yes. We, all of us over here, we watched your performance. I mean, uh -huh. it was an amazing performance, and not just me. The whole community was watching you and supporting you. I know. I, I, I want to thank everybody for supporting and watching and, you know, voting and stuff. And everybody was sending their, their friends and family in Trinidad and saying, hey, vote for it. Um, in the end of it, it all comes down to the judges. Is it, I, I, in my opinion, I don't think it doesn't matter how much votes you get. It comes down to the judges and everybody in Trinidad who is involved in the Chutney Soka Monarch. Is there anything you felt you should have improved on that you didn't do at I the show? I would not change anything that night that I did. I opened with Extreme Breakers. Um, I had a Lavender Dance group dance for me. It's amazing to see those girls, what they did, you know. I wasn't even there and they practiced without me. And to see what they put on the stage, I was, I was amazed. I, I was impressed. Which I knew the group I picked because I know they could back me up. Extreme Breakers, they didn't even have time to, you know, think about what they'll do. But those guys are so good, you know. They did it. Mm -hmm. And I have, it to, I have to give it up to them because, you know, they're impressive. It looked great. I mean, my personal opinion, I was watching, it was one of the most exceptional performances of the night. Everyone did great. Yours, to me, really woke up the crowd, and I was proud I, to see I that. I had a great response yeah. from the crowd. Mm -hmm. Oh, my God. I, I thought, you know, I wouldn't have a great response, but that crowd was going. It was, they were talking back. Oh, yeah? You talk to them, they talk back. They wanted to party. They wanted to get down, and it was semifinals. There you go. And remember, the outfit was amazing again, thanks to Renew. Um, she did an awesome job on that outfit. Um, I think you guys are really good with that deciding. She mm -hmm. has to design my birthday outfit coming up in a month. <laughs> <laughs> and we got to start planning that party too. Oh, God. <laughs> <laughs> um, is there a chance that you'll be going back? Um, 
I highly don't believe I will be entering back that. It was just based on experience and, you know, I got to experience being on the stage, seeing the crowd, doing what I love, and that's it. Um, me personally, I do my music, I perform, I'm already around the States, and I'm very content with that. I don't need to go up, you know, for any other competition. And I don't believe really in competitions, but it was like, again, about the experience, so. What about Guyana? Any plans for Guyana? I want to do some shows in Guyana. Not competitions, shows. Just shows for the people. Oh yes, shows for the people. I want to go and, you know, do different shows in different borough or different places in Guyana. <laughs> I mean, there's places all around. I mean, you have every, every county in Guyana. And right, um, every county. There we go. We have um, Esquire, we have Burbies, we have Georgetown. Yeah. And they love you in every county, so you'll be well received over there. Um, I am going back to Trinidad though for Carnival and I'm going back to um, actually my new song coming out is actually with um, Stinky. Okay. Maha Productions again, Rishi Mahatu and um, Stinky is actually going to be on my song and we'll be doing a video for that when I nice. back down so we'll finish it up. Very nice and you know Runway TV is actually going to be at Carnival sending back some footage over here. I so know, I'll be uh, maybe co-hosting with your boy down there. Well, we'll look see. out, well, if you see Trickster, you see the hat? Dick Trickster, Trickster, <laughs> come here, let's go. The man's going to be there and uh, you know, hopefully we get some footage of you and Stinky over there. Um, Yeah, sure, for the video. I mean, that video, we're going to make it into something that, that, that that's about the song, you know, like, mm -hmm. like a real video. So. Very nice. I think he's pretty excited about it. So he's good. He's a great artist. He's a great artist. I think um, he has um, he has a great voice. Um, he could perform really well. I personally look at performance on stage. You mm -hmm. know, if you could perform, you could sing. You're good to go. There you go. What's next for Sexy Mercer? Um, doing a lot of music and just doing what we love. Music, you know, performing, doing different shows. Uh, you know. Maybe we'll do our own stuff in New York. Shh, don't say. <laughs> chup ke, chup <laughs> Actually, tonight, uh, you and I are working together at the grand opening of Lime Bar. That's on 171st Street and Jamaica Avenue. And I know you've got a nice performance planned for that, and we'll be filming live from there. So it's always a pleasure working with you. I'm happy to actually to be to, um, doing the grand opening for the Lime Lounge because um, it's a personal friend of mine also that you know that owns it, um, Darren, mm -hmm. and um, I'm very happy of doing that for him. Um, it's a wonderful Hopefully, place. you know they have a great turnout and we rock the crowd. There you go, and I like the place too. I mean, I've been there. It's, it's... very classy. Mm -hmm. um, it's not like you know any particular kind of looking bar type of thing. Mm -hmm. um, I think it's very classy the way he did it. Oh yeah, very elegant. Everything's brand new. I mean, you can smell the new wood finish. It's going to be an awesome night. So I think it's going to be awesome. Hopefully, you guys come out. We'll be there. Runway TV, sexy Marissa. It's going to be hot. Trix is going to be in the house. We're going to be interviewing. So come on out, Marissa. This is part two. It was part a pleasure two. again. <laughs> At least he didn't drill me this time. <laughs> this time's a bit more relaxed. We're happy you came back. I so, know, in peace and quiet. <laughs> there you go. Well, thank you, Runway TV, for having me, as always. Um, it's always my pleasure being here. Any last-minute advice for viewers or any, anything you'd like to do? I, you know, I know you got a new song. Last time you did uh, Don't Rock It So Slow for us. Right. What's coming up next? It's called Rumors. Um, that's all I can say for now. <laughs> it's called Rumors. Rumors. Is that a rumor or is it true? I don't know yet. We have to think <laughs> about it. <laughs> nice, nice. Well, you know. Don't I, Google it. I'm <laughs> <laughs> gonna find something you don't want to oh find. <laughs> Sputtin. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, th it's great to have you back. Thank you for coming out here once again. Thank you for having me again. We Jason. wish you wish you the best of luck. We'll be working together tomorrow and hopefully again in the future. And I know it's not the end of Sexy Mercer, it's just the beginning. So stay tuned and share. Uh, a little advice for the young folks who's thinking of singing and, you know, doing anything with your life. Don't ever give up. Remember, there's always a chance for you out there. And I believe in giving everybody a fair chance. Absolutely. And well don't said. Be shy. I know a lot of people are shy. You know, they come and they're like, hey, but it's inside. Bring it out. Well said from the lady herself. Viewers, Sexy Mercer. We'll catch you next time. Hopefully, interview three is going to be, who knows what it's going to be. Oh, go ahead. But it's coming. <laughs> Part three is coming. It's a trilogy. Marissa, thanks again. And viewers, thanks again.